Live from the Vermont Center for Community Journalism, this is News 7 at 5.30. Mortality isn't always an easy topic to discuss, but tomorrow marks a day of awareness for important long-term health decisions. News 7's Justin Chenette reports. Have you drafted your advance directive yet? An advance directive is a written document that could be more easily described as a living will or dual power of attorney. If I got hit by a truck today and I, I had a head injury and I'm not going to get better, um, do I want to be kept alive on a, on a breathing machine? Do I want to be kept alive with, with feeding tubes? It's really for that worst case scenario. Lynn Burgess, who is the director of chaplaincy at the Northeastern Vermont Regional Hospital, has been working on advanced directives for the past 15 years and has even published an informational brochure to help simplify the process for people beyond just those in the Northeast Kingdom. It, it goes all over the country, so it had to be more, less state specific because each state has their own rules and laws. Tomorrow marks the National Health Care Decision Day that is always held the day after tax day each year since it was declared by Congress back in 2008. It's meant as an awareness not necessarily of mortality but of preparing for important life choices like advanced directives. Anyone over the age of 18 can come here to the Northeastern Vermont Regional Hospital in order to get assistance from the Director of Chaplaincy and to sift through all of the necessary choices and fill out the documentation needed to make an informed decision for their advanced directive. We don't want to focus on the death part because really it's about living. It's about how do you want to live up to the time that you're not. But how do you how do you want to live? Justin Chenette, New 7, St. Johnsbury. For more information, you can visit www.vtethicsnetwork.org.